Let's be honest, there's something about building a network rack that's just, yeah, perfect. I love building a network rack. It's just one of those things. That's the tech stuff that I love. So when it came time to build this rack for my Grand MA lighting console, I thought this is the perfect opportunity to have some fun. Upstairs, I've got a massive 48U rack, but I need to build this rack because I've got a production coming up that needs some tech. I think the best place to start is for me to explain what I wanted to be able to achieve out of the rack. So while I wanted a large switch, my current setup has a small switch, which is kind of working. I'll show you that in a moment. It wasn't doing what I needed. It wasn't enough ports. It needed to be bigger. I needed to be able to put the show Mac in here and another Mac mini. This is the server running all of the web stuff that I need to be able to access. They needed to go in the rack, they needed a home and a safe place. I also needed Wi-Fi, so I've got a unified access point in here. I didn't need the coverage to be large, I just need some access so that when I'm here with the Mac, I can talk to the rack and get communication. One of my key things was PoE. You need an access point, it's got PoE. I've got network switches, they need PoE. So I got a 48 port PoE switch. So let me start by showing you my current setup that I've got before I built the rack. And then let's go back to me building it because this is going to be an adventure. So this is the new kit that I've bought. 